In this video, I will show you how to uninstall Roblox from the Microsoft Store on Windows 10. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see on the Microsoft Store. So I'm currently on the Roblox app page. As you can see, there is a button to play, but there's no option here to actually uninstall. So to go ahead and do this, what you're going to want to do first is come back to your desktop. Then what you want to do is come down to the bottom left hand corner and just go ahead and type remove apps into the search box. Underneath best match, you should now see apps and features. So go ahead and give that a click. That's going to take you across to a screen like this. Now what you can do from here is come to the search box here and just go ahead and type Roblox into the search box. As you can see, there's a few different instances of Roblox coming up. So the Roblox player is the actual web-based version of Roblox that you download from roblox.com but the Microsoft Store version is this one here. So it's an actual app as you can see it says Roblox by Roblox Corporation. So this is the one you're going to want to uninstall so to do that just click onto the app and you're going to see an option here that says uninstall. So what you can do is click uninstall, then click uninstall again. And what it's going to do is uninstall this from your PC. So you will now see if I close this down and open up the Microsoft Store. So I'm just going to do that now. Now we've got the Microsoft Store open. What I'm going to do is go ahead and search for Roblox. And if I click onto the Roblox app, you'll see there is just the button which says install instead of play. So we now know this has been uninstalled. So that's how to go ahead and uninstall the Microsoft Store version of Roblox on Windows 10. With that being said, I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.